Oh, dang, I look good. Oh, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by me. I purchased this unit with my own coin. Now, today is really special because my girl, Faith, asked me to collab with her, and we are both doing the same wig, just in different colors. Now, most of you guys know her as Still Looking Good 58 on YouTube, and for the longest time, I thought 58 was like, you know, just a random number. No, that's how old she was. And get this, she is now in her 60s. Okay, 60s, y'all. And when I say my girl is looking right and tight, skincare routine. Drop it now. Faith, you are doing the dang thing in this wig. I love it. And for my older wig babes who want to see how the wig may look on them, check out my girl. Hit the notifications, okay? Because you're going to want to see the looks. So I will drop her video link down below. So make sure you guys check her out after my video, okay? Be, be cool. Be cool. <laughs> And I didn't forget, it is also Sip and Slay. Listen, your girl got her Stella Rosa peach in a can. Thanks, Ken Ken, cause, ooh. <laughs> Y'all, cause he found these for me, mm. But anyway, before we get into this install, the specs, and what I think about this unit, share out the pack. Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from Outre. It is from the Nisha Soft and Natural line. This is Nisha 206. I got her in the color S1B slash 30. And this unit does retail around like 30 or $40, depending on where you buy her from. I got her when she dropped two years ago, but I just did not review her. It does come with the normal cap construction, so lace from ear to ear. Here, two combs in the front, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. Now it does come in a deep center lace part. I've seen other people um, turn their wigs to the side to get a look like that. I may do that, I don't know. I'ma leave my combs on, or not combs, I'ma leave my adjustable straps in the back to see how this unit is fitting on my head. I think she's fitting pretty good. I don't have on my wig rip and I don't think I'm wearing it with this one because it's pretty much giving me a perfect fit. Now with the Nisha line, when they first dropped, it was given like, you know, semi pre plug hairline. Everyone was on it. I'm pretty sure we gave that hairline a little bit more credit than we should have, but at the time that was good for synthetic wigs. We hadn't seen hairlines like that on synthetic wigs except for um, the sensational What Lace series, but that is an actual lace front. The Nisha lines are not lace fronts. They are lace part wigs, but they were given a little bit more or, you know natural hairline in the front to give you a more natural look with the lace part wigs it is real tight so I will go in and pull some hair out the front right here as well as in this parting space because it's not given what I need her to give but before I do that I'm gonna put my powder on this wig using my mocha 360 powder where is my brush I can never find my brush I'm gonna do that put it all around my lace and down my parting space just so I can make sure I can see it, you know what I'm saying? I may use the sides of this wig because I think I wanna do like a half up, half down style for this look, but we'll see once I put her on. Go ahead and cut a slit in my lace. Make sure I don't pull it too tight, I don't wanna rip it. Oof, that'll be tragic. All right, let me pull this back. And you're just cutting the lace off. All right, so lace is off. Now let's do something with this hairline because it's not giving me anything. <laughs> Now for your pull method or tweezing method, just take your time. Because I've been doing this for a while, I know how to just, you know, pretty much grab and pull. But if you are new to this, take your time so you don't bust a hole in your wig. Nope, that's too much. Now, if you struggle like I did right there on that one piece to get that hair out, that means it's too much, you know, that you're trying to pull at once. Okay, let me brush this out. So the hair is flowing pretty good, but it's definitely giving, like y'all like to say, the Oprah bob. <laughs> y'all know I ain't mad at that okay Oprah got money and I'm trying to get money too so uh silence <laughs> oh wait a minute this is giving <laughs> this is giving healthy hair doobie wrap yes it is so I need to flatten this out right here so I'm gonna use my blow dryer on warm and low to get this flat Okay, now it does say this unit is heat safe up to 400 degrees, so I'm in the clear. I don't know if I'm gonna do a V yet. 
I don't know. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup really quick and then we're gonna come back and we are going to get this unit styled up um, in some looks. Okay, so makeup is sitting. God dang, I look good. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna spray this down. I'm gonna let it kinda, you know, sit how it's sitting now. But I do want to kinda touch up that hairline just a bit. Contour, contour. This is my Juvia's Place foundation stick in the color Katsina. I'm gonna do a little bit around my hairline. I don't wanna do too much. So I don't want it to be like super dark, especially when I go outside. Oh, I think my package is here. I just heard him close that door. Mm-hmm, my package is here. <laughs> told you, told you. <laughs> All right, let's do our parting space. I'm gonna use my Maybelline Fit Me powder in the color 330 Toffee. If I need to darken it up, then I will do that. My part is a little crooked. There we go. My eyes be lying, so I don't know. <laughs> okay, let me just blend that in with my contour brush. All right, so now to make sure the hair is right. Get my paddle brush. Okay. Let's brush it on out. I don't know why this side is kind of flipped out. What's going on? There we go. Gotta put a little bit more contour over there. It's a little ashy. Look up. Blend it into your mirror so that when you look down, you, you see that? Okay. My girl Sherelle, AKA Natural Joy. I'm sorry, she's not Natural Joy anymore. She's simply Sherelle now. But yeah, she taught me that um, a couple years ago, so. All right, this, I got this little lace over here. Just gonna fold it back. Like that. Rub the hair around the hairline like that. Got some neck huggers right there, and I don't, y'all know I don't like that. Brush it back, brush it back, way back. <laughs> I am getting some shedding with this wig, and it was shedding prior to me pulling some of the hair out. Let me just tuck my sides in so you don't see the lace. Let me just make sure my hairline is good. Okay, y'all, this is this is cute, okay? If you want a wig to step into the fall with, go ahead and start with this one, sis. <laughs> like I said, this unit dropped about two years ago and I can understand the hype that, you know, that y'all were given because, yeah. Now, I will tell you, with the Nisha units, they will get stiff over time, especially because this is a textured synthetic wig. It will get stiff, okay? I mean, <laughs> stiff. Okay, so you might wanna buy a couple of these joints, all right? This is a good look, though. It's a good look, it's a simple look. Now for me, I would consider this to be beginner friendly. However, if you are not comfortable pulling out hairs in your wig or in your parting space, then this may be a little bit more intermediate for you. But overall, I feel like this unit is a good buy. I feel like it's a nice unit, the texture is nice. This is definitely more of the yak yak, so I'm here for that. This is definitely giving healthy hair. It's giving my mom never gave me a perm. <laughs> And I love that for me. Okay, I love that for me. <laughs> Let me come up close so you guys can see this unit. Okay, see the hairline, nothing crazy. I didn't cut the V like I normally do, but I don't feel like it, you know, distracts from the unit. So I feel like it looks pretty, pretty daggone good. We can also see how good this unit looks up in a ponytail. That's not my hair, y'all, that's the wig. So you can pull that up like that into like a little ponytail. Let's see if this is gonna look right. Cause not everything looks good in a ponytail, so you know, we'll see. Fix my glasses. All right, just comb it. Let me put it back under, like that. You can definitely add some more hair to that ponytail cause it's a little, seems a little thin, but I like it y'all, okay. What do y'all think? That little part, I think I rubbed some of the contour off, hold up. So um, is this gonna bring the heat? Of course, okay, it's a textured synthetic wig and it's given like a bob cut, it's gonna bring the heat. But in this transition to fall, you can do it. I would definitely consider this to be a three-in-one wig, work, church, happy hour, mm-hmm. She's not really giving me like, you know, super movement, but she, you know, she fluffy. I, I really don't have no complaints. Uh, well, mm, pause. <laughs> 
The hairline and the parting space could be a lot better, but they don't say that this is a, you know, a pre-pluck unit. It is part of their lace front series and most times they don't really give you that. However, for the Nisha soft and natural line, they were giving us the hairline. So yeah, you know, Utra kind of skimped on the rest of these. So yeah, those are the wigs right there to come in the Nisha line, but they did just drop a new one. I don't know what number that is, but I saw it on wig type. So you know your girl had to get that one too. Now I don't know when I'm gonna review it. <laughs> You may be waiting another two years, but you know, she gonna be on my shelf, so we'll see. <laughs> But that's all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to Faith for collabing with your girl. I really appreciate it. Her links to her video will be listed down below, so make sure you guys check that out, as well as the link for this wig. So if you wanna check it out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.